Have you ever felt like happiness is a destination always just out of reach? Like you're chasing after something you can't quite grasp? We all crave joy, peace, and fulfillment in our lives. But so often we find ourselves stuck in cycles of negativity, self-doubt, and unhappiness. Why is it so hard to break free from these patterns and experience lasting joy? The truth is, the path to happiness is often blocked by our own minds. We unknowingly create agreements with ourselves, limiting beliefs and patterns of behavior that hold us back from experiencing the joy and freedom we deserve. But what if I told you there's a way to break free from these self-imposed limitations? In this journey toward unlocking true happiness, we'll explore four powerful agreements that have the potential to transform your life. These agreements, outlined in Don Miguel Ruiz's insightful book The Four Agreements, offer a roadmap to personal freedom and lasting joy. We'll dive deep into each agreement, uncovering its hidden depths and practical applications. You'll discover how to break free from the shackles of self-limiting beliefs and embrace a life filled with authenticity, peace, and genuine connection. Get ready to embark on a transformative journey toward unlocking your inner wisdom and creating a life you love, one agreement at a time. We often struggle with negative self-talk, take things personally, make assumptions, and judge ourselves harshly. These common pitfalls keep us trapped in cycles of negativity and prevent us from experiencing true happiness. But if I tell you there's a way to escape these traps and create a life filled with joy, peace, and fulfillment, by embracing the four agreements we can challenge these negative patterns and replace them with empowering beliefs and habits. Throughout this video, we'll explore practical strategies and techniques to help you integrate these agreements into your daily life, leading you toward a brighter, more fulfilling future. The first agreement, be impeccable with your word, might seem simple at first glance, but it runs much deeper than just avoiding lies or harsh language. Many people underestimate the profound impact their words have, both on themselves and those around them. We often engage in negative self-talk, gossiping or complaining without realizing the damage these words inflict. We might think it's just a few words, no big deal, but words carry immense power. They shape our thoughts, beliefs and even our physical reality. Think about a time someone said something hurtful to you. Did those words stay with you, impacting your mood or even your self-worth? Now imagine the opposite, the power of kind, encouraging words to uplift and inspire. So how can we become impeccable with our word? It starts with awareness. Pay close attention to the words you use both internally and externally. Notice any patterns of negativity, judgment, or gossip. Once you're aware of these patterns, you can start to shift them. Instead of engaging in negative self-talk, practice self-compassion. Replace those critical thoughts with kind, encouraging ones. When speaking to others, choose words that are honest, kind, and uplifting. Avoid gossiping or speaking ill of anyone, including yourself. Remember your words have the power to create, to heal, and to inspire. Living by this agreement might feel challenging at first, but the rewards are immeasurable. As you become more conscious of your language, you'll notice a profound shift within yourself and in your interactions with others. You'll experience greater peace of mind knowing that your words are aligned with your values. Furthermore, your relationships will flourish as you communicate with authenticity and kindness. People will feel heard, respected, and valued in your presence. By speaking with integrity and love, you create a ripple effect of positivity that extends far beyond yourself. Remember, Every word you speak is an opportunity to create beauty and connection in the world. The second agreement, don't take anything personally, is often easier said than done. But truly grasping its essence can be life-changing. We humans are wired to seek connection and belonging. So, when someone criticizes us or acts unkindly, it's easy to internalize their words or actions as a reflection of our worth. We might think, what did I do wrong? Or why don't they like me? Here's the liberating truth. Most of the time, other people's actions have very little to do with us. Everyone is living out their own story shaped by their past experiences, beliefs, and insecurities. Their reactions to you are often a projection of their own inner world. When you take things personally, you're essentially letting someone else's baggage weigh you down. So how can we stop taking things personally? It starts with understanding that you have a choice in how you react to any situation. When someone says or does something hurtful, instead of immediately reacting, pause and observe your thoughts. Are you letting their words dictate your emotional state? Practice detachment. Remind yourself that their actions are a reflection of their own journey, not yours. Instead of taking their words or actions as a personal attack, try to see them with compassion and understanding everyone is battling their own demons. 
The more you practice not taking things personally, the lighter you'll feel. You'll free yourself from the constant need for external validation. Imagine no longer being at the mercy of other people's opinions or moods. Your sense of self-worth will no longer be dependent on the approval of others. This newfound freedom allows you to show up in the world with greater authenticity and confidence. You'll be able to express yourself freely without the fear of judgment holding you back. Remember, true freedom comes from within. Don't give anyone the power to dim your light. The third agreement, don't make assumptions, encourages us to step back from the stories we create in our minds. We humans are expert storytellers. We take a few bits of information and weave elaborate narratives, often without even realizing it. We assume we know what others are thinking, feeling, or intending, even when they haven't explicitly told us. These assumptions might seem harmless at first, but they can lead to misunderstandings, conflicts, and resentment. We build resentment towards others based on our imagined interpretations of their actions. We might even sabotage our relationships because we're acting on assumptions rather than reality. So, how do we break free from the trap of assumptions? Well, it's simple. Communicate. Instead of assuming you know what someone else is thinking or feeling, just ask. Approach conversations with curiosity and a willingness to understand their perspective. Share your own thoughts and feelings clearly and respectfully, without expecting others to read your mind. Remember, clear communication involves both speaking your truth and actively listening to others. When you communicate openly and honestly, you create a safe space for understanding and connection. You allow relationships to flourish based on authenticity rather than assumptions. Living by the agreement. Don't make assumptions can be incredibly liberating. Imagine the freedom of releasing the weight of unspoken expectations and imagined scenarios. Instead of carrying the burden of assumptions, you create space for clarity, understanding, and stronger relationships. When you choose to communicate openly and honestly, you cultivate deeper connections with others. You build trust, foster intimacy, and create a foundation for authentic relationships. Remember, true connection thrives on understanding, not assumptions. The fourth agreement, always do your best, might seem straightforward, but it's often misinterpreted as a call for constant striving and pushing ourselves to the point of exhaustion. We live in a culture that glorifies achievement and productivity, often leaving us feeling like we're not doing enough. The pressure to constantly perform and excel can be overwhelming, creating a cycle of stress and burnout. We set unrealistic expectations for ourselves, striving for an elusive perfection that leaves us feeling perpetually inadequate. This pursuit of perfection can be paralyzing, making us feel like failures when we inevitably fall short. Here's the liberating truth. Your best is not a fixed point. It fluctuates. It's a dynamic concept that changes from day to day, moment to moment. It's influenced by a myriad of factors, your energy levels, your emotional state, and the circumstances you're facing. On some days you might feel energetic and motivated, ready to tackle any challenge that comes your way. Some days your best might mean conquering a challenging task, while other days it might mean simply resting and recharging. It's important to recognize and honor these fluctuations without self-judgment. The key is to meet yourself where you are, without judgment. Embrace self-compassion and understand that doing your best doesn't mean pushing yourself to the brink. It means being kind to yourself and acknowledging your efforts regardless of the outcome. One way to practice this is by setting realistic goals and celebrating small victories. Instead of focusing on what you haven't achieved, take time to appreciate what you have accomplished, no matter how small it may seem. Engage in activities that bring you joy and fulfillment. Whether it's a hobby, spending time with loved ones, or simply taking a moment to breathe, these activities can help you recharge and maintain a healthy balance. Practicing gratitude can also shift your perspective. By focusing on the positive aspects of your life and acknowledging the good, you can cultivate a sense of contentment and well-being. Mindfulness practices, such as meditation or mindful walking, can help you stay present and connected to yourself. These practices encourage you to listen to your body and mind, allowing you to respond to your needs with compassion. Remember, doing your best is about being true to yourself and honoring your unique journey. It's about finding peace in the present moment and recognizing that you are enough, just as you are. Embrace your imperfections and celebrate your progress. Life is not about achieving perfection but about growing, learning and becoming the best version of yourself. So, let go of the myth of perfection and embrace the beauty of your imperfect, authentic self. In doing so, you'll find a deeper sense of fulfillment and joy in your everyday life. Always do your best but remember that your best is a reflection of who you are in each moment. It's a journey not a destination. 
and on this journey, you are enough. So, how can we live by this agreement without falling into the trap of self-criticism and pressure? It starts with self-compassion. Acknowledge that your best will vary from day to day, and that's okay. Release the need to compare yourself to others or to some idealized version of yourself. Instead of focusing on perfection, focus on progress. Celebrate small victories and acknowledge your efforts no matter how small they might seem. When you approach your endeavors with this gentle and accepting attitude, you unlock a wellspring of energy and motivation. You're no longer driven by fear of failure but by a genuine desire to grow and learn. Living by the agreement. Always do your best liberates you from the shackles of self-judgment. When you know in your heart that you're showing up fully in each moment, giving it your all, you create a profound sense of inner peace. You release the need to criticize yourself for past mistakes or perceived shortcomings. This doesn't mean you become complacent or stop striving for improvement. It simply means you approach your journey with kindness and understanding. You celebrate your successes, learn from your mistakes, and keep moving forward with a heart full of gratitude and self-love. We've journeyed together through the profound wisdom of Don Miguel Ruiz's Four Agreements. Be impeccable with your word, don't take anything personally, don't make assumptions, and always do your best. These agreements, though seemingly simple, hold the power to radically transform your life. They offer a path to break free from self-imposed limitations and embrace a life filled with authenticity, peace, and genuine connection. Remember, these agreements are not about achieving perfection, but about progress. It's a journey of self-discovery, of shedding old patterns and embracing new ways of being. It's about choosing love over fear, understanding over judgment, and freedom over limitation. Imagine a life where your words are infused with kindness and integrity, uplifting yourself and those around you. Imagine the freedom of no longer being ruled by the opinions of others, of standing firm in your own truth and worth. Picture the peace that comes from releasing the need to assume, from embracing open communication and understanding. Envision yourself moving through life with a deep sense of self-compassion, knowing that you are always enough, always doing your best in each moment. This is the life that awaits you when you embrace the Four Agreements. It's a life of greater joy, deeper connection, and unshakable inner peace. The journey starts with a single step, a single choice to live in alignment with these powerful agreements. It's about integrating these principles into your daily life, moment by moment. Some days will be easier than others, and that's okay. Be patient with yourself, and remember that every step you take toward living these agreements is a step toward a more fulfilling and joyful life. So, my friends, are you ready to embark on this transformative journey? Are you ready to unlock the wisdom of the Four Agreements and create a life you love? Remember to like this video and subscribe to the channel for more inspiring content. The power to transform your life lies within you. Start today.